Oh, thanks for calling Penn Express. Uh, the Lover's House, can I help you? Hello? Hi, can I help you? Hi, my name is Matt. I'm calling from the cable company. Just confirming that a repairman will be over to your house between 12 and 4 tomorrow. Uh, this is a business. Really? That's yes. strange. You I have people here work. scheduling a service call. Uh, let me see. What's the address do you have? <clears throat> so, no one from your home called us? No, this is not a home. This is a business. All right. It says here that someone wanted to install a family filter on your cable box. Does does that uh, ring a bell? Um, no, this is a business, this sir. This is so strange. So I'm pretty sure it's not. I, I, uh, I really apologize. No one, no Let me calls. see here. Just a quick second. Okay. What's the address you have? Uh, looking at your activity. Um. um oh. Oh my. Um. Well. Um. Th this is a little awkward, but uh, someone has ordered some adult movies on your account. Nope. <coughs> yeah, I'm wrong, I'm I'm the wrong it wasn't you. Uh, yeah, I, I don't want to get anyone in trouble, but it, it looks like about eight movies were purchased in the past week, about nine dollars each. Uh, no, we don't we don't have we don't even have a TV here, so yeah, I'm pretty sure you got the wrong number. I'm really sorry about all this. Mm -hmm. No it problem. It looks like these charges are non-refundable. That well. <laughs> Look, like I said, I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job here. That's okay. We if we get the building. If you we'll, like, we'll I can transfer later, you to the customer yeah. service line. Just please hold. No problem. <laughs> You've just been pranked by PrankDial.com.